Too much. 
much and okay, I have to say it out. So, baby, I love you, I miss you. Can you please come over? Does that ring a bell? I mean, at least I know you must be remembering all the times you were in and out and in and out and in and out and in and out and then you even forgot to come back. Oh. <laughs> you see, fuck your perfectly bright smile. Screw your sexy biceps and you can go to hell for all I care with those pink lips of yours. <laughs> yeah, you can, you, you, you can go to hell. I don't really want you to go to hell, but you can go to hell. <laughs> so I want to I want to unlove you, I want to untouch you, I know you, and feel you, and come for you, and wine for you. I just want I want to stop loving you, but it's really hard. It's really hard, but you know what? Screw it all. If my heart cannot let you go, then I will simply let it go. Because I feel like the empty dark space is way better than the images of your dark, dark face. So, you know, it's really hard sitting in the middle of the night with a half empty can of glue trying to piece the, trying to put back the broken pieces of your heart together. And just as you're done fixing the whole thing, you realize the glue is actually done, so everything just collapses and falls back. Yeah, so as I was putting the heart together, it crumbled and fell back and crumbled and came back and crumbled and I tried, I kept, I kept on trying to fix it, but oh god, you, you, I do not like the way my brain thinks about you, even on the days when I'm thinking about beautiful things, man, you just keep on popping up in my head, it's not fair, you are invading my privacy. I keep on invading my privacy over and over and over and over and over and I keep on praying that, okay, I keep on thinking and I keep on thinking that if I ignore you and ignore and ignore and ignore and ignore you, you will just disappear or stop existing. It, you know, it's really hard to do that if I, if, if I have to keep on seeing you every day like you're just there. Tell me how does it feel sitting like that, feeling so high, but you're far away to call me, even though I'm the one who put you up there. Laying in the sky, does it ever get lonely, thinking you can leave without me, leave without me. Tell me how does it feel sitting like that. I honestly want to stop thinking about you. You see, you used to be mine, but I guess it's fine that you aren't anymore. So you see, I would never love you again, even if my life depended on it. You know why? Because you tied explosives to my little heart, maliciously and yet so skillfully. Then you went ahead and pressed that detonator like you didn't know I would suffer an emotional miscarriage in the end. Who does that? So, baby, due to emotional, physical, spiritual, visible and invisible reasons, the light at the end of the tunnel has been removed for you. Now there's bullets at the end of the tunnel. 